Welcome to Survival on a Budget Made Easy. In this video, I'm going to show you how to clean your humidifier. Now, this is the humidifier I got from Pure. It's probably about two or three years old now. Now, basically, all humidifiers are going to be the same. So, if you, even if you don't have this, you might want to tune in and learn how to clean yours right after this. Welcome back to Survival on a Budget Made Easy. Like I said, we're cleaning our humidifier. Now this is the pure, filterless humidifier. I'll have a link to the video I did on this down in the description box. And I'm on town water, and you can see the gunk that builds up in it. Now this part here, you just kind of pull out. Got a little gap there now. There we go. Throw that in there. And that's that's made to come apart, so don't worry. See we need, we're getting gunk already out of it. I got really hard water here. Take the cap off. Now this ain't real hot water. It ain't real cold water, it's just lukewarm water. A cup of just regular chlorine bleach. The idea is to make sure you get as much water in there as possible so we can clean it for you. Now with your base, you can see how scummy it is on the inside. Take my measuring cup. And yes, make sure you have the power disconnected, electricity off. You now unplug it from the wall, whatever you got to do. I know some people are going, well, you ought to be using vinegar to, to get the hardness out. Well, with this way, I'm getting, a, I really don't have hard water stains. I just have all that gunk build up. So I want to clean it and disinfect it, not really remove the hard water stains because I don't have hard water stains. But right now, it's 1041, Monday, January 24th. We'll come back after a while, we'll take a look at it, and finish cleaning it. Okay, it's been a couple hours now. And you can see the water got real cloudy. And you can see where it didn't get everything out. Right there on the bottom. But like around here, it comes right off. And you can see right in there, hopefully, there's gunk in there yet. So what we're gonna do, maybe you can see it better that way. Uh, 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 uh. There you go, gunk. Take our bottom brush, get down in there. Getting a little wild here. Now, what I was doing about every half hour or so, when it was laying like this, I'd walk by, flip to the other side. So that way, both sides got leech water on it.
just take the back of my knife out okay there's that piece as you can see it's pretty well clean if you're worried about the hard water stains are left behind Take some vinegar, put it in there, let it sit overnight, and that should get rid of it for you. Put this right here, I guess. Now this here, just gonna dump. I mean, that come that comes right out. Once again, if you worry about the hard water stains, just dump some vinegar in it, let it sit overnight. Our top, our bottom. There we go. Now, when you first run this, it will have a little bit of a bleach smell to it, but that will go away. Don't get too worried about it. back in there like that. There you go. And that's it. Hopefully you found this video helpful. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. I'll have a link to this down below so you can check that out. Also, do not wear good clothes when you are doing this. The bleach will ruin your clothing and carpeting, so be careful. As always, thank you for watching.